Next up tonight, Bowman Draft, number 35. Torres B.O.B. with the Yankees, Young Boone Rockies, Red Raider Giants, Mod Squad A's and Indians, Cody has the Royals, Davis Red Sox, Vampire Sports, number two pick Angels. Cranky Yankee White Sox, Jay Fern Rays, Thanos has Phillies and Astros, Jay King Pirates, Turkish number one pick Twins, also the Brewers at three, Blue Jays and Diamondbacks and Mets. Uh, Seabass, Reds, Marlins, Cubs, and Nationals. Doc has the Braves. Reverse negative Mariners. Mr. Bonnie Smalls, Rangers. Tim has Padres, Tigers, and Orioles. And TBR, Dodgers, and Cardinals. Mick Davis, did you not get the, the draft ranking thing? You weren't random, the Red Sox. You got the 20... What pick did you get? You got the 22nd pick in the draft. It doesn't look like you ranked your draft. After you bought the spot, it should have directed you to a... to a page where you could rank the teams in your preference. And then it just runs a draft based on that. It runs a random to get the draft order, and then it looks at your lists and gives you your highest ranked team when it's your pick. Did you not get a, a not get an email or it didn't redirect you to the draft? You should have also gotten an email that tells you that too. Maybe it went to your spam folder or something? Start with a Jake Berger. Jake Berger base auto. Wait, was there an insert in there? Nope. All right. Hold Brandon. We lost Davis, McDavis. He was there and he asked and then I tried to answer and he just disappeared. I don't know what happened to him. <clears throat> Kyle Lewis, silver paper. Yeah, it drafts for you, so you don't have to be... Because live drafts take a million years. Taylor Walls, blue for the Rays. Jay Fern, I don't think we get Taylor Walls that much. Maybe we do. I've never seen... Yeah, so what happened, Dave? You, you got the Red Sox, which were the default third, uh, 22nd ranked team. Which So it's not like you got... Don't worry, you didn't get... Like some terrible team you got a, you know the appropriate team for your spot if you would have ranked it you you still would have gotten the you know the 22nd pick so. anyway check your email you should have an email from me at whatever address you used to register on the site that gave you a link brian miller purple paper and actually when you bought it it should have redirected you to it
essentially if you don't rank your draft everyone knows this but if you don't rank your draft it is pretty much a random because you're going to get a it's still a random for the draft order and then you'll just randomly get whatever teams in my default ranking there so and look at that cole brandon you got an autograph see it didn't work out too bad davis his hand-picked red socks Corey Ray silver paper. Anyway, next time you'll know. Next time you buy into a drafted break, wait after you check out. It should direct you to where it is. And David Thompson green. Well, if you guys fill that football mixer, I'll probably be forced to post some baseball to reward you. Uh, I'm never going to get out of here. I just want to lay down. Actually, I got nothing to do tonight. It's fine. I'm going to lay down all day tomorrow. <laughs> hey, even with a DS team, Embro, if you get a DS team, you're going to get a uh, a good odds uh, outcome to win the uh, promo stuff. So, you know, you can't lose. You can't lose! Caden Lemons. Unless you get a Caden Lemons somehow. Poor Caden Lemons. Did I say if you fill that football mixer? I meant if you filled three of them, because I can do three of them with the case of Leaf uh, Best of Football and, and, and Impeccable. Fill three of those, and I'll for sure post like a Panini low-end optic um, Chronicles Triple E Prism. Maybe. Insert auto of, it's a gold, Tristan Lutz, class of 17. Well, I think it, actually it's not a gold. Yeah, it is. It is a gold. <laughs> Hippie's out. Oh, good night, Hippie. We barely knew you. <laughs> Kramer. Zach Kirtley, base auto for the Cardinals. <laughs> Someone say optic. It's down to 11 spots. They're so hungry for more breaks. They'll even buy football. I'm telling you, that mixer is a good price for $300 in giveaways. It's, I'm not even... It's like a break-even for me. Probably not even break-even. It's a good deal. Scott Hurst Purple. I know. Damn, prove me wrong again. Will Benson. Just once, I'd like to be right about a break not filling. <laughs> Doc knows my game. He's been around long enough. Matt Tabor, blue paper. I mean, we definitely can't fill three of them, though. There's no way. No chance. 
Uh, purple autograph. Blaine Enlow. Turkish, your number one pick twins. A purple Enlow. <laughs> Remember when there was box toppers in this stuff? I had to have done seven, eight cases with no box toppers. Like weird. They just don't exist anymore. Nick Allen, blue paper. There is a Quinn Brody black refractor auto for the Mets. Turkish. Turkish is coming back. Recovering from his Bowman's best debacle, maybe. Was it a debacle? I don't know. The draft was. TJ Zook. Sorry, the video is choppy. The football mixer is going to be uploading for the rest of our lives. So, Espinosa. Like a 600 gigabyte file. Seventieth blue Mark Bientos. Oh Bientos. Mark Seth, you ever go to Bientos in the pocket area? I love that place. That's my favorite Mexican food restaurant. Griffin Canning for the Angels. They have this hot salsa, like warm warm salsa. Oh mama. So good. I wanna go there right now. Uh, Sam Carlson. What is this thing? Wow, that's like the first one we've ever gotten of that. What are those called? Draft Night. Those are super rare. Super rare. Sea bass. Oh, they're not really that rare. That's gold number to 50. We've never hit one, though. That's cool. <laughs> I just thought of the dumbest thing. I was like, I wonder if he signed that on draft night. And there's a picture of him on draft night. <laughs> That'd be pretty hard to pull off. Let me get your picture. All right, we're making this into a card right here. Now can you sign it? It would be cool if they did sign it on draft night, though. Or they had cards that were signed on draft night. Cade McClure. Tractor Auto, Corey Abbott. I feel like we're getting all the teams that have one subject. You're automatically in. You don't have to do anything. That's the beauty of it. That's why I love it so much. I don't have to do a squares pools mixer. All right. Oh, yeah. I forgot to say that. Wait. Ember, are you talking about the mixer we already did? The big football mixer we already did or the, the one I just posted? I mean, the answer is the same, but if it was the one I already did, you could see what thing you got. AJ Puckett Purple. The one just now? Okay, yeah. I'll show you. After after the draft runs, you'll see what, what team you have and what points you need them to win by. But if you look on the product page right now, you can scroll down to where underneath where the boxes are. 
basically scroll down all the way to the bottom of that page. You'll see this little grid that shows like what what team you get for what pick in the draft you got. So you'll know right after we run the draft what you've got to root for. It's hard to explain. I wasn't good at explaining it all week, but maybe after we do this a couple times everyone will remember how it works and then it'll make sense. It's very, it's not complicated at all. It's just different. Francisco Rios silver paper. But basically the idea is the worse you do in the draft, the better odds thing you get. Connor Wong, refractor auto for the Dodgers. TDR. So. That way, if you get a terrible pick in the draft, at least you're like, well. Yeah, if you get the Chiefs winning by seven or whatever, it's like, it's a good chance. Noni Williams, orange. Number one pick, it's the Bills winning by 10 or more, just to give you an idea. Um, Trading, I don't know. I don't want to keep track of it. Tuki Toussaint, purple. And nothing. I don't really care if people trade whatever things they have, but I don't. How am I going to, when do I cut that off and how do I track it all? You guys got to email me and say you're trading this or that, I guess. I don't want to mess it up. And a gold McKenzie Gore defining moments. Under that, oh, Bubba Thompson. Is that two cases in a row, Bubba Thompson? Mr. Bonnie Smalls. No, I'm not hating on the bills. I just went to the... I went to a Vegas odds website and looked at like the average odds for the games yesterday and just made it based on that. According to Vegas, the Bills winning by 10 or more is the least likely scenario this weekend. I think. Christopher Sace. I'm sure it's not perfect, the, the order I made it, but it's close. We got it. Gold Wave Auto. Gold Wave, Gold Wave. Mackenzie Gore. Tim. Tim's in heaven right now. Mackenzie Gore, Gold Wave, Tim. Hmm. Well, there is a little problem right there. Little back corner bandage, Tim. I didn't do it, I swear to you. I just looked at it. Can't grade it. KJ Harrison 70th. That's the problem with checking the condition of the cards right away. Damned if I do, damned if I don't. If I don't check and I send it to you and you're like, dude, you damaged this card. And I'm be like, oh, I should have checked it. It was probably damaged before I even did anything. But if I do check it, I have to tell Tim that his beautiful gold wave McKenzie Gore is a damaged corner and it's just like a Takes the wind out of uh, Tim's Padres pitcher sales. You can't win. Life, Jules. You can't win. Bubba Thompson. No one gets out alive. Franklin Perez. Usually they're in good shape. 
Our Beckett order should be in on Monday, so... Helio Ramos! Nice. Red Raider. Should I look at it, or... I don't see... Uh... I don't see any obvious damage. Now I'll send it to Red Raider and it'll be absolutely mangled. And Cade McClure for the White Sox. Cranky Yankee. Look at that noise outside. Time for your break now. Oh, you're in Revolution. Coming up next, Jules. Coming up next. Lucas Ersig Blue. I moved to four to five days a week. The demand is still higher, Jules. You got to get on one day a week, Jules. Purple autograph. Look at the Red Sox. Brett Nets are purple now. What a pick, Davis. Man. Guy's a wizard with the draft. He saw those Red Sox, ranked him number one. He knew it. Say you want a red. Lane Enlow, green paper. One of the worst Beatles songs. Still okay, but... Sorry, Omni, this has nothing to do with you. I just... I've always thought that. And Gavin Sheets. How many White Sox autos have there been? <laughs> Jules isn't breaking it. She's not breaking it. She's going to get all the best Alonzo hits. Espinosa, like she always does in her basketball breaks. First Jules wins the DraftKings, and then she parlays that into a Alonzo. <laughs> That's your favorite Beatles song? No way. I really hope you're joking right now. Mackenzie Gore, 70th Blue. You can forget about that trip. There's no way I'm flying out there to hang out with somebody whose favorite Beatles song is Revolution. There's this. Can trip canceled. I don't care how many other amazing qualities Omni has. That one is a deal breaker. I mean, I guess you didn't say Yellow Submarine or... Other terrible Beatles songs, are there? Oh. Yellow Submarine is pretty terrible. Christopher Sace. <laughs> Wings. Beatles rule. They just have a few songs that suck. Oh, Hey Jude is the worst. Sorry, I forgot about Hey Jude. The song's terrible. Dalton Jeffries. Let's talk about Beatles songs. Bowman drafting Beatles songs. That's what everyone wants to talk about. Down to five on the football mixer I swore wouldn't fill. I'm such an idiot. Charlie Barnes. Turkish. Cummins knows what's going on. George Harrison, the best Beatle. Eh, nah. But he's awesome. John was the best Beatle. Paul and George, pretty close. I love George Harrison. He's amazing. Was amazing. Poor George. <laughs> Old people talk. 
You should have been there in the 60s with the Beatles. It was amazing. Taylor Trammell Blue. A Day in the Life. It's a good one. MJ Melendez. Wait, is the day in the life the uh, green? What the heck? White Sox. Gavin Sheets. Cranky Yankee. Is the day in the life the uh, I read the news today, oh boy, one? Where, where uh, John is singing at the beginning and then it. The change, like Paul has a part of the song he wrote. Cash Case Blue, still never seen his autograph. Octopus's Garden is bad. Good call. Yeah, that's... That is a... That is a really good song. I love that song. Omni Knows. Blaine Enlow. Repeats. Maxwell Silver Hammer. I don't know about that. I don't think that song's that bad. It's okay. Octopus's Garden sucks. Good call. Anything Ringo did sucks. Sorry. Sorry, Ringo. I still like Ringo, but no. Those are all dumb. And Trevor Clifton Purple. Come on, the verse melody of Maxwell Silver Hammer, it's awesome. It goes all over the place. The chorus is kind of dumb. It's too repetitive, but... The verse is really good. Wyatt Mills Silver Paper. Man, the video is really stuttering, huh? It's football mixer. Still not done downloading or uploading. Purple Buddy Reed and Ryan Villard for the Rockies. Eleanor Rigby's fine. Fine song. I really like Martha, My Dear. That song's amazing. Lincoln Hensman. That's a Paul song. Blackbird's amazing. Everything on Help is amazing. <laughs> That's all my parents listened to when I grew up. Chris Oak uses this like the Beatles is it. Beatles and Beach Boys. Well, pretty much all the oldies, but that's the albums they had and they played all the time. Freaking Beach Boys. So good. And Brett Netzer. We have a Blue Wave Shane Baz. Jay Keen. <laughs> Octopus's Garden. So dumb. Yeah, 17 Bowman Jumbo is crazy high. It's shot up the last month or so. It's been shooting up every day. I, I'm i almost out, and I was going to buy some more cases, and I saw how much they were, and I was like, ugh. I don't know. It's so high. 
Wyatt Mills Gold. The Akuna Hype. Yeah, Blackbird rules. I can play Black. I sent Jules. Jules, you know that thing I was playing that I sent you? That was Blackbird. Probably didn't even know that. DL Hall Blue. That's a fun song to play on guitar. A little finger picking and stuff. And Campusano for the Padres. Sigh. When I'm 64 is pretty bad. You knew it, but you didn't. Well, not like I played it perfectly. It's kind of crappy, so I'll give you give you a break. Green auto, no. Juan Hillman green. Akuna in draft? Does he have a rare insert auto or something? Yet another case with no box toppers. Damn, I want to talk about Beatles songs. No one wants to talk about it. Where's the old crew? Don't we have any old guys around here? Drew Strotman. We had him earlier tonight. We had a gold in uh, Bowman's Best. You missed it. Kevin Newman. Sweet gold Acuna from Bowman's Best, the last case. Trap and Joggers Millennial? What? The heck is he talking about? Uh, Tommy Doyle, Refractor Auto, for the Rockies, Young Boone. I don't know what trap is. A trap, whatever that is, no idea. JJ Purple Paper. What's on Revolver? I don't even know the out. I just, we used to just listen to all the songs. And I'm not good at remembering. Except for Help, for some reason. I know the songs on Help a lot. I know all their songs, but I don't, I can't remember what's on Revolver. <laughs> Rubber Soul. Uh, Nick Prado. Rubber Soul. Rubber Soul, Rubber Soul, Rubber Soul. Oh, techno music. I stopped keeping up with music stuff, new terms of music when they're with that rap that's like the auto-tuned mumbling. What is that? It was like on NBA 2K. I was like, what is this? Orange Scott Hurst. They just like kind of mumble and it's all auto-tuned. That's the genre now, I think. Connor Uselton Green Paper.
Blue Auto. Come on, baby. Sam Carlson. Seattle Mariners Blue. <laughs> Sports Talk Radio. That's pretty much all I listen to. Tax Man. That's a good one. Is I'm Only Sleeping on that album? That's an unbelievable song. Freaking John Lennon. Peter Alonso. I know that album now. Taxman, what else is on there? I think I'm Only Sleeping is on that. Last pack of the break. Uh, Tommy Doyle, Blue 70th. All right. Let's see what we got in the hit recap. I'm Only Sleeping is one of my favorites. Seemed like there was a lot of color, though. Kenny Vigor. There was a lot of color. Wow. Insert color. Oh. No Beatles fans in here. Okay, fine. Fine, what do you want to talk about then? Fine, young people. So, hit recap. Gold Wave, Mackenzie Gore. Trevor Rogers, Gold Draft Night. I think that's the first Draft Night auto we've hit out of 30-something cases. Taylor Walls, Blue. Oh yeah, Tristan Lutz, Class of 17, Gold. Gavin Sheets, Green. Shane Baz, Blue Wave. Sam Carlson, Blue. Blaine Enloe, Purple. Brett Netzer, Purple. Refractors of Corey Abbott, Connor Wong, Tommy Doyle. Base autos of Prado, Campusano, Villad. Enlo, Charlie Barnes, Gavin Sheets, Cade McClure, Helio Ramos, Bubba Thompson, Griffin Canning, Quinn, oh, that's a black refractor. Quinn Brody, black refractor. Zach Kirtley, Cole Brannon, Jake Berger. <laughs> Washed up at 34. I'm 37, so. Mm-hmm, 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 I know I'll get some YouTube comments about the worst Beatles song. One person will. Noni Williams, Orange. Mackenzie Gore, Defining Moments, Gold. Wyatt Mills, Blue Tommy Doyle. And here's the rest of it. Scott Hurst, Orange. It's like you guys only watch sports or something. Can't talk about Pokemon or the Beatles or... What else were we talking about that you guys don't like? What other things have I tried to discuss that get little to no response from the chat? Pretty much anything. Uh, I guess I have to go to my old standby, which is making fun of Jules. I don't know what else to talk about. Did you see the, them on the Ed Sullivan? Wow, that's awesome. 